last video, we learned how to convert degrees to radians. Now let's see how we can add or subtract angles that are already in radians. The most important thing to remember is that tau is a number just like 1 or square root of 2. Its value is approximately 6.28. Let's start with the review of how to add fractions. If I was asked to add the number 1 to 1 half, I would start first with finding a common denominator. In this case, the denominator would be 2. So 1 half plus 2 over 2 equals 3 over 2. Similarly, to add 1 tau radians to an angle that is tau half radians, we would first start by finding a common denominator. Notice that this, that this is the same type of fraction as before, so we want the denominator to be 2. Now we can take tau halves and add it to 2 tau over 2. The sum is 3 tau over 2 radians. To subtract, we do the same thing uh, that we would do when subtracting any fraction. Say we wanted to find the difference when we subtracted 3 halves from 7 halves. Since they already have a common denominator of 2, we simply subtract the numerator. We subtract 3 from 7 and get 5 over 2. To do this with angles, we can start with an angle that is 7 tau over 2 radians and subtract from it 3 tau over 2 radians. Again, we have the same denominator, so 7 tau minus 3 tau gives us 5 tau. Thus, our answer is 5 tau over 2 radians. As you can see, adding and subtracting angles in radian measures is just like adding and subtracting fractions or even whole numbers. Make sure to watch the rest of our videos in this Tau for Trig series.